Hi friends, welcome to Fragrance of Joy. Hope all of you are doing great and this is your host Chijo. Today I just want to share with you uh, my take on the Tom Ford fragrances that I have. Um, an amazing fragrance house um, from US and uh, he's a fashion designer and uh, by collaborating with various uh, fragrance uh, perfumers um, he created um, a wide range of fragrances um, and he has uh, some amazing collection out there um, which is called the private blend um, let me just uh, give you a quick update on what I have here the first one you see here uh, that is Tom Ford Black Orchid uh, which is an EDP concentration and also let me show you the other one the newer one uh, here which is the Tom Ford Black Orchid perfume so basically it's a warm spicy um, earthy like sweet kind of uh, gourmand kind of fragrance uh, which uh, has a unique feature of uh, black truffles and black currant combination it also has patchouli which adds that sweet chocolatey vibe earthy vibe to it and it's very earthy and woodsy and it's an amazing fragrance popular among uh, all sex um, so the other one I want to show here is this one that is tobacco vani uh, which is very famous uh, most of the people like it it came out in 2007 it's a very sweet uh, vanilla like tobacco warm spicy fragrance which is very apt for the cold weather Mm, and uh, the name as the name implies it has the tobacco and uh, vanilla note, vanilla note uh, which gives that uh, sweet touches to it and it's very warm comfy but it's very strong uh, so it has notes of tobacco leaf and some spices some dry fruits and cacao vanilla and the combination gives an amazing long-lasting uh, fragrance and uh, the next one you see is Oud Wood, which is a very classic, uh, manly kind of uh, perfume, which is very uh, amazing, subtle, um, not offensive at all. It's a great scent and which is uh, kind of balsamic, you know, woody and has oud. Uh, it is not like skanky oud, but it has very pleasing uh, aroma to it and uh, which is a very classic and it has some rosewood agarwood combination with uh, you know sandalwood and uh, uh, added sweetness by tonga bean so it's an amazing fragrance uh, the next one is one of the amazing creation uh, i would say this is the masterpiece by tom ford it is amber absolute it was one of the originals um, it came out in 2007 so it's very balsamic uh, smoky vanilla ambery incense combination with a lot of labdanum so which gives you that spicy classic um, you know feel to it it's very mature it is very suitable for uh, winter it's very warm and cozy an amazing fragrance and uh, um, it is discontinued now um, the next one is also an original from 2007 it's called tuscan leather which is very famous among all age groups uh, which as the name mentions is a leathery fragrance combined with some fruity touches uh, by raspberry and uh, it has the you know, leather and suede knots and some woodsy uh, combination knots mm, also has some uh, spices like saffron which adds that unique um, long lasting fragrance so very classic it has that smoky uh, uh, warm oomph leather and uh, it's an amazing those three uh, this amber absolute tuscan leather the tobacco many are the most uh, i mean long lasting fragrance in this collection uh, the next one i put it here because of the same size the 100 ml it is the venetian uh, bergamot uh, which is um, a sweet nice uh, fragrance very uh, flowery an amazing fragrance uh, i would say it is uh, lean more towards the ladies uh, but um, it's an amazing fragrance it's nothing wrong in it uh, it has citrus floral spicy combination has uh, some bergamot on the top you know uh, added with magnolia 
and uh, some kind of um, some patchouli is there uh, i think patchouli or sandalwood uh, i think it's sandalwood could be because it's creamy um, uh, in the base and it also has some ginger uh, pepper uh, you know in the notes uh, added with amber which gives it a floral uh, woodsy and citrus spicy kind of combination um, it is also a long lasting it's a pleasing one amazing one from uh, tom ford Uh, the next one is also very popular it's called uh, noir de noir um it's an amazing fragrance by uh tom ford so this one is kind of um like you know the rose and some chocolatey aspects to it um it is a nice fragrance among uh you know various age groups um another uh, one of the you know uh specification of this uh, fragrance is is very dark and uh, intelligent which has the rose combined with uh, similar to that black orchid some truffles going on there uh, which gives that chocolatey uh, earthy uh, in a character uh, by uh, added uh, patchouli it also has some saffron uh, agarwood and uh, vanilla combination there so it gives more depth and uh, spiciness it's a floral uh more leaning towards the feminine side of the things okay let me go to uh, the top portion here as you see that's a amber absolute uh, that one was re-released uh, recently that was a recent bottle of 50 ml no much uh, difference uh, among uh, the older one um but which is uh, similar touches but it may be uh, less potent because maybe the ingredients are kind of rearranged but it is the same scent the next one is an amazing uh, fresh scent clean fresh citrus neroli um, combined uh, fresh combination this is tom ford neroli portofino brought a lot of them uh, similar to that i think uh, a lot of blue bottles uh, this one i think this is original so this is an amazing a uh, fragrance uh, which is loved by all age groups um very fresh it came out in 2011 uh, very citrus aromatic uh, neroli combined with uh, mandarin and oranges um, it gives that more citrus uh, which has an amber uh, and uh, musk you know the amber uh, base so it's not a long lasting but it's fresh you know like out of um, shower kind of perfume amazing uh, creation and look at all the bottles it's amazing the next one is the one i showed earlier that's a tuscan leather a smaller bottle um it's the same thing there um let me go to the this one i showed you already this is the uh, perfume version uh, of the black orchid uh, which ha- it is earthy and mossy uh, similar kind but it has some added plum note uh, some boozy notes that's the main difference uh, it gives you more richness to it uh, with the patchouli and the black truffle combination um, so it is the most recent release so edt is more uh, projecting in the in the opening and this one is more complex and added uh, character to it um, we go to the next one this one is a classic one this is tom ford noir extreme uh which is very popular uh it is also i think it came out in 2013 uh, which has a specific character like um, a sweet of um, indian origin i mean um, oriental nature called kulfi uh, it has that sweetness uh, the opening uh, which has vanilla and some oranges um, it's kind of amber filled oriental balsamic sweet spicy has some spicy notes like cardamom uh in there combined with some amber and woods and sandalwood creamy base so very pleasing uh, lasting long uh, so that sweetness and balsamic touches guys uh, makes it more apt for fall and uh, winter uh, the next one is uh, another uh, like an original is called the lavender palm uh, it came out in i think it came out 2011 uh, not 2007 so this is a little more late so this one is refreshing uh, you know it's very elegant aromatic floral um, it has lavender uh, as the name suggest 
uh, lemon bergamot it has some added palm leaves uh, maybe that name uh, specifies it's a unique scent um, with uh, some berry water and you know moss base with the tonka bean uh, it's an amazing fragrance i think they discontinued that uh, the next one is um, the italian cypress uh, this is another amazing creation by tom ford um, which is a woodsy classic um, aromatic spicy combination it came out in 2008 i guess um it has italian cypress uh, that's a major note in there uh, with added citrus and some mint and the woody character to it um it's a classic one um it lasts also for a long time i don't know whether it's available now uh the next one is tom ford lantern uh this is uh, i think th- this came out in 2000 maybe like 13 uh, that period of time is very warm spicy balsamic a uh, combination has some added pepper and cumin and saffron that spices give us a unique um, nature to the opening notes and some people may not like it uh, but uh, well as the fragrance develops um, it uh, brings out the wood and incense and some birch and cedar in the base uh, amazing fragrance as a collective purpose it's nice but do you have to go and hunt for it no uh, there are some other amazing fragrances out there the the next one is this one is uh, ombre leather 16 uh, which came out after as a follower of um, tuscan leather uh, which become more um, you know more wearable um, like some people are so um, you know cannot wear that uh, tuscan leather it's a classic Uh, this one kind of little subdued type would see leather um, it has some violet uh, you know uh, violet leaves on the knot and it has combi- combinations of cardamom patchouli and oak moss so would see leather fragrance it's very amazing and they came out with a new ombre leather uh, but as since i have these um, i had not spent time to go for the other one so the next one is tom ford wood floor um this is uh one of the scents i mean i like it it's not anything sp- you know special about it since 2013 it came out like a wood sea shipra uh, it co- combined rose combined with wood patchouli sandalwood and you know s- some resin touches to it gives that balsamic qualities um it's an amazing fragrance uh, nothing uh, ground breaking the next one is tom ford tobacco wood intense this one is an amazing fragrance uh, there is a predecessor uh, that is the tobacco wood but this one is intense so it it has the similarity to uh, the amber absolute uh, so when when you spray this one it reminds you of the uh, amber absolute um, it's a nice fragrance um, what what you get is uh, balsamic wood see you know the tobacco note uh you know it has some uh, animalic touches uh, with castorium it uh, has patchouli and oud combined with tobacco uh, very amazing fragrance long lasting it's a nice one the next one is uh, tom ford uh patchouli oud um which is a patchouli bomb uh, so basically uh, so it's like a woodsy balsamic or tea patchouli um yeah, patchouli added with uh, leather oak moss uh, has some bay leaves and amber and cypriol which makes gives it more depth um you know that spicy combined earthy uh, character uh, gives more woodsy a classic manly uh, kind of if you like uh, amen kind of fragrance uh, try this one the next one is uh, tom ford what be and kens this one is um, like a, they they came up with uh, some fragrance line uh, focusing on the green notes uh, so this is a woodsy balsamic uh, woodsy green uh, perfume which has a pine you know as an note so it gives you a wood resin um, character to it it has some added incense and balsams um, so it's like basically tom ford's interpretation of uh, green notes the next one is a tom ford uh boy morocane uh which is i think it is discontinued now it's an amazing fragrance 
um, this one is um, kind of what we call it's an old kind of smell it's i think they are mainly focusing on the uh, middle eastern uh, population there it came out in 2009 it's like woodsy spicy com- combination with various woods notes like cedars uh, you know cypress combination has some uh, patchouli and incense at the base um, some very were so this uh, combination gives a unique touch uh, like a middle eastern white to it the next one is an arabian wood it's an amazing fragrance here uh, this one uh it's a classic very nice so this one uh, also as i mentioned earlier the focusing on the middle eastern uh crowd uh, i think they came out specifically for the kuwait market so it's a wood sea sheep rape it's uh, it has this, uh, added rose oak moss jasmine um some sweet notes like honey and tonka bean combination at the base it's a long lasting one um i think it's discontinued too it's not available anymore um the next one is the most recent one from tom ford um you know this is uh, the bordejour uh, bordejour this is a classic uh, figure uh, from uh, like lavender barbershop kind of uh, fragrance from tom ford uh, a nice one uh, is it's like aromatic figure um uh, fresh spicy wood see it has the lavender and uh, rosemary geranium and uh, some amber and oak moss uh, i think it's some added uh, you know patchouli at the base it's an amazing scent uh and very pleasing uh and it's not offending it's very uh, has the character long lasting uh, and amazing so these are uh the chomford uh various perfumes i have in my collection so um hopefully you enjoyed uh this review of i mean the interpretation and my first impressions on the tom ford uh so it's an amazing house okay let me uh, i forgot to mention this one this is an amazing uh fragrance that uh came out and is no more available it is sahara noir so it is a balsamic uh, you know warm uh, very strong and very long lasting uh, perfume by tom ford um, so basically uh, very would see balsamic spicy like middle eastern vibe uh, with uh, the initial notes of orange uh, you know incense and cypress has some beeswax and um, benzoin and cinnamon Uh, which gives that depth to it um is unfortunately it's not available anymore so it is one incense bomb uh it's an amazing fragrance um so this is my take on the tom ford and i hope uh, you guys really like it and uh, thank you for watching